welcome back to our channel. Today, we have an exciting destination to explore, Bath, located in southwestern England, is a historic and picturesque city known for its Roman-built baths and Georgian architecture. Its iconic Roman baths, the stunning Bath Abbey, and the elegant Royal Crescent are popular attractions. Bath's thermal springs, vibrant art scene, and charming streets make it a captivating destination. If you're planning a trip to this UNESCO World Heritage Site, we've got you covered. Here are the top 15 things to do in Bath, England, so, without wasting time, let's get started on our journey. Number 1. The Roman Baths The Roman Baths Step back in time at this marvel of ancient architecture and engineering. The site is much more than a bathing complex, it's a sacred space where the Romans once mingled with gods and goddesses. The museum showcases incredible finds, from delicate jewelry to well-preserved offerings to the divine. Don't leave without sampling the legendary healing waters, once believed to be a gift from the goddess Sulis Minerva herself. Number 2. Bath Abbey Next, Bath Abbey with its heavenly fan vaulting and soaring spires, the Abbey is a masterpiece of perpendicular Gothic architecture. It has been a site of Christian worship since the 7th century, witnessing coronations and countless daily devotions. The climb up the tower is rewarded with a striking view of Bath, while the Abbey floor tells a deeper story through centuries-old memorials and ledger stones, each a narrative of the city's storied past. Number 3. Thermi Bath Spa Where ancient tradition meets modern luxury, the spa invites you to soak in Britain's only naturally warm, mineral-rich waters as the Celts and Romans did 2,000 years ago. From the rooftop pool, you'll experience unmatched views of Bath's skyline. A visit here is not just a dip into soothing waters, but a serene encounter with the essence of rejuvenation that has drawn travelers for centuries. Number 4. The Royal Crescent the epitome of Georgian elegance, this iconic landmark comprises 30 houses arranged in a sweeping crescent. Its uniform facade belies the individual stories within, best discovered at number 1 Royal Crescent, now a museum. The crescent, set against green lawns and blue skies, offers a timeless view that encapsulates the grace and history of Bath, with each stone whispering tales of the city's grandeur. Number 5. The Circus this remarkable architectural triumph is a stone's throw from the Royal Crescent. Designed by John Wood the Elder, the circus is a circular space surrounded by grand townhouses, their facades decorated with emblems of classical antiquity. Stroll around the circle and look up to spot the acorns on the parapet, symbolizing Bath's druid past, as the circus was believed to align with the sunrise on the equinox, connecting the earthly to the celestial. Number 6. Jane Austen Center Bath's most famous resident, Jane Austen, comes to life at this dedicated museum. The center offers a snapshot of her time in Bath, providing context for the city's influence on her writing. Immerse yourself in Regency costumes, attend a talk about her life and works, and finish with afternoon tea at the Regency Tea Room, where you might just feel the spirit of Austen's wit and observation accompany your cup of tea. Number 7, Pulteney Bridge One of only four bridges in the world lined with shops on both sides, Pulteney Bridge is a marvel spanning the River Avon. Designed in the Palladian style by Robert Adam, the bridge offers stunning views of the river and the crescent were below. It's a place of movement and stillness, where the waters flow beneath as shoppers peruse above. By night, the illuminated bridge is a beacon of Bath's romantic allure. Number 8. The Holborn Museum In the stately Sydney Pleasure Gardens stands the Holborn Museum, home to a collection of fine and decorative arts. Once the Sydney Hotel, the building itself is a magnificent piece of Georgian architecture. Inside, masterpieces by Gainsborough and Stubbs await, along with a spectrum of silver, porcelain, and the intriguing story of its collector, Sir William Holborn. It's a sanctuary of art, inviting contemplation and discovery. Number 9. Prior Park Landscape Garden 
Designed by the poet Alexander Pope and landscape architect Capability Brown, this 18th-century garden offers sweeping views down to the city. The highlight is the Palladian Bridge, one of only Number 10, the Fashion Museum. Housed in the assembly rooms, the Fashion Museum is a sartorial treasure trove. The collection spans from the 16th century to the present day, showcasing everything from sumptuous silk gowns to bold modern designs. Interactive exhibits offer a hands-on understanding of fashion history, while the dress of the year display captures the very essence of contemporary style. It's a vivid walk through the world of fashion, where textiles and textures narrate our cultural evolution. Number 11 A Victoria Art Gallery Near Pulteney Bridge, this public art gallery, named to honor Queen Victoria's Diamond Jubilee, holds an impressive collection of British oil paintings and works on paper from the 17th century onwards. Its dynamic temporary exhibitions ensure there's always something new to see. The gallery is a tranquil retreat where the brushstrokes of history come to life in a dialogue between classic and contemporary works. Number 12, Bath at Night. As the sun dips below the horizon, Bath's honey-colored stone takes on a warm, ethereal glow. The streets come alive in a different light, where historical facades are illuminated and the city's nightlife begins to stir. From the subtle ambience of the gaslit streets around the Theatre Royal to the vibrant energy of bars and eateries in the Artisan Quarter, Bath at Night is an enchanting experience not to be missed. Number 13, Milsom Street Shopping For those with a penchant for retail therapy, Milsom Street offers a blend of high-end brands and independent boutiques. This historic shopping avenue has been serving Bath's fashionable visitors since the 18th century and continues to be a bustling hub. Whether you're after the latest trends or one-off artisanal finds, Milsom Street is where Bath's historical flair meets contemporary shopping. Number 14, Bath Festivals. The city's calendar is punctuated by cultural celebrations, from the Literature Festival in spring to the Mozart Fest and the Jane Austen Festival. Each event transforms the city into a stage where music, literature, and art are celebrated with passion. Participating in these festivals is to live Bath's cultural heartbeat, offering moments of connection with artists, writers, and fellow enthusiasts. Number 15, Bath's Secret Gardens. Escape the bustle of the city in Bath's hidden horticultural havens. From Henrietta Park to the hidden garden of Queen Square, these secluded spots offer a quiet refuge under the canopy of ancient trees and amongst flourishing flower beds. They are perfect for a picnic, a leisurely stroll, or simply a moment of peace, with each garden telling its own story through the landscape. And there you have it, our top 15 things to do in Bath, England. Whether you're interested in history, architecture, nature, or relaxation, Bath has something for everyone. If you've been to Bath before, let us know your favorite spots in the comments below. And if you're planning a visit, we hope this guide helps you make the most of your trip. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more travel inspiration. Thanks for joining us today, and we'll see you in the next video.